Let's solve one previous question of algorithm analysis. This question was asked in GATE CS 2024 set 1 question number 7. Given an integer array of size n, we want to check if the array is sorted. It may be ascending or descending order. An algorithm solves this problem by making a single pass through an array and comparing each element of the array only with its adjacent element. The worst case time complexity of this algorithm is and four options are given. So here the objective of this question is to check whether that array is sorted or not and that we can do in single pass means we can traverse the array from left to right and we can check whether the array is sorted or not. So for array traversal it need order of n time right so in worst case for array traversal to check whether it is sorted or not it will take order of n time so here answer will be option a both order of n and omega of n omega of n means it may be greater than or equals to n and order of n means it may be less than or equals to n answer is option a both order of n and omega of n in option B, it's written order of n but not omega of n. Due to this not omega of n, this is wrong. And option C, not order of n. Due to this, it is wrong. Option D, both are wrong. That's why it is wrong. Simply, you can write theta of n. If you are writing theta of n, it will be both order of n and omega of n. It's equals to some constant multiplied by n, right? As it's not written theta, you can write it's order of n and omega of n. I already discussed asymptotic notation. Just go through the lecture. And if this lecture is helpful for you, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.